now I'll bring Drizzy the fuck up for five mil. Of course I would. And we gonna let Nikki be the ring girl. <laughs> I know I gotta work on my legs. This ain't your shit, but you a nigga. Why you looking at my leg? It's done. Y'all come to see that fight, wouldn't y'all? Y'all spend a hundred dollars a ticket for that. Check it out now. Let's get ready to rumble. Now, I've been trying to see this fight for a motherfucking long time. Drake versus Meek Mill. Meek Mill is now entertaining the idea. Now, while streaming live on Instagram, he said, yo, I wouldn't have a problem beating the fuck out of Jersey for $5 million. Now, with that low of a price tag, and I know it's hefty to us broke niggas, but somebody could front $5 million, and if we could get Drake to agree, right? We would definitely want to see this motherfucking fight. Y'all been going back and forth. Ghost Riders getting beat up. Everybody getting touched other than the two motherfuckers that got issues with each other. What the fuck? Let's go. Now, I don't want to even see Soldier 4 versus uh, Chris Brown. I don't want to see 21 versus 22. I don't even want to see Rick Ross versus 50 Cent. I want to see Meek Mill versus Drake. Okay? Now, he also tossed into it. Nikki could be the ring girl. That was probably a little tongue in cheek because a lot of people keep leaving Nikki comments on his post saying he misses Nikki. But obviously, he said she could be the ring girl. I don't give a fuck. But yo, somebody got to make this happen. Please, please. We got to send this to Diddy. We got to send this to Floyd. We got to send this to Fenty. Please, we got to make this happen because if any beef in rap, and actually, I believe this is what kind of started back and spurred beef again in rap. Because if you remember, like, over a couple of years ago, everybody was all cool with each other, all right? After 50 Cent Wave died down, people realized that beef is not profitable for your career long term. So people stopped beefing. Everybody became friends. But, of course, shit got boring. Shit wasn't lit. And then we get Meek Mill and Drake, and that's when it got popping. So in all reality, man, I'm just hoping that somehow, some way, this actually happens. If you ask me my prediction, listen, I don't even want to sound... I know y'all y'all say, I know who you're going to pick already. I would pick Meek because he's from the streets of Philly, but I seen him handle a bag, and I don't think he could knock shit out. I think he need a gun in his pocket. I don't know if he could fight. Matter of fact, he told me he can't fight. And when the nigga tell you he can't fight, I'm going to believe him. So even if I want to pick Meek, I can't. The nigga told me he can't fight. But he says he's now willing to fight for $5 million. So I got to rock with Jersey. I got to rock with Jersey. Okay? Now, if it was anybody else, I would probably pick... Actually, I can't pick Meek in no situation. Nicky said he can't fight. Nicky said he's 170 pounds. He don't fight. Come on now, bro. Come on, bro. And maybe that was just to the game because the game is a big Samoan-looking motherfucker. But goddamn, when you say you just don't fight, I'm like, well, what could we do? We ain't going to have a real shootout, which I want to do, play Call of Duty. So I don't know. What do you guys say, man? Who you got, Meek or Drake? Meek Mill says he's down to fight Drake for five milli. Somebody make it happen. Put us in the universe. Let's see it. Make sure you guys like, definitely subscribe. Ayo, like my new Instagram. We only about 20,000 away from getting 100,000. Let's get it. I'm out.